that yellow line there with the key is. Yeah. And now we're gonna go dead spray. So what Alex is going to do here is what we call sitting into the shot. So the sequence is still the same, the ball's still moving first, but what he's doing such a great job at and what he realized on his own to make sure that his shoulder doesn't pop forward and to make sure that he's getting under the ball, he's going to drop his level a bit more, but the ball's going to kind of stay put where it was. That's like, I feel like that's how you worded it, right? So the ball, ball kind of stays put and allows him to drop and get underneath that basketball, which signal, like it signals the push up to the two and then everything flows underneath. But if you're, if you're somebody that struggles with sequence to begin with, Alex knows so much at this point that, that won't, that's not going to bother you at all, right? But if somebody that doesn't understand ball first and all this and the timing that we're trying to figure out, that could be a bit problematic. But for Alex, sitting in that shot is going to get him under and then keep everything straight along his right side while really pushing, pushing that shot line that we want for, through uh, two through. So just shoot a, shoot a couple. Ciao. So kind of how you did this first one when we sprint into the corner. I'll hit you with the same footwork. We're gonna. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's fine. And if it looks as good as that, then we're all good to go, dude. Ooh, that was nice though. Just when you drop, really sink down. Lead with your butt down to the ground. Okay. Really sink. That was. That was actually. And then I'll be nitpicky for this last part. Let's try to keep our shoulders more to the rim the whole time. So catch. Got it. You know what I'm saying? You turned him again. Yeah, I did. I took my head off. Yeah. Now, exactly what you did, but then drop it. Oh, I didn't drop it. You one-toot it. And then use this step 
Go 90% of the way on the step. Quick, quick drop after. Beautiful. So we'll go four more of those. Level stays. I'm gonna challenge you on that drop to sit into your shot even more. Three more. Right. That's it. Last one. You didn't, watch this. You didn't go that way at all. You just went down up. We're just making breakthrough after breakthrough on this beautiful Wednesday. If you think about what we did to begin with, when you were at top of the key, right? And you just went from high to low, right? This is, this is all this is now. You're just, it's the same movement, except now it's, we're just elongating with the dribble. So we're here. And then we make that dribble, hands, sit, shot. Get that right foot around. Try to go. Still back yeah, but try try to go more full foot on the drop. Doesn't have to be entirely full foot, but be concentrated on it to get more full foot down than you otherwise would. When you're when you're stopping, your right toe is like pointed here. Right? So you gotta think, if, my, if I were to stop and my, my toes pointed that way, I have to come back this way, right? There's, there's gonna be some rotation. So when you, when you make that drop, get that right toe to the rim, because that's gonna bring your shooting shoulder to the rim too. That's gonna help balance-wise. Does that make sense what I'm saying? Bingo. Good job, buddy. So we'll go slide, catch and shoot, corner, focusing on everything that we are catching, doing, right? Boom, shot, okay? After that shot, drop. After this shot, make or miss, then it's gonna be a slide, catch, rip baseline, elevate shot. We need eight, we got four, five. Right. Great feet, sit. Seven. Game ball. One of them. Need one of them. So go back to the corner. We're going to finish on the one dribble pull up. So when you come up, again, this is where you don't have to square back up on this side. Yeah. Our toes pointed here, fine. It's, if we're going right, I don't want my toes pointed out. But if I'm going left, dude, I, you can shoot this ball like this. You know what I mean? Yeah. That doesn't make a difference. So keep, your, keep everything going that way and just have it come off your right shoulder. Bingo. Much better. Again. Much better feet. Beautiful. 
So it's like, you gotta figure, going left, we don't have to be nearly as precise. Yeah. Right, going right, it's gonna take longer. But going left, do exactly what you did there. Cause then speed stop, boom, you're up, you're up into that shot. Which you need, because if I'm guarding you, right, you come out and you catch on that drop. Even if I'm guarding you here and you're going to this side, I'm on where I'm at, so take your dribble, I'm on your strong side. Yeah. Right? So I'm almost at an advantage because I know this ball has to come back here. Right. But your ability to stop on a dime, not have to worry about how you're positioning your feet, and then just to elevate, gotcha. it's a big piece of it. Two. Three. Four. Six, seven, game ball, finish it, finish it here in the corner, come on. So right around, right around here. I'll let you decide. But then all your, just, just nice to finish out. Just working on hands, sinking into that level. And then we're up to that shot. Yeah, so sit more. And then every, every, the moment you begin to move, your shot starts, right? So if you're, even if you're here with the ball, you, would, you wouldn't dribble like this, yeah. right? So you're here, just throw it to here. Just like I would pass from here, I would dribble from here, I would shoot from here. You move, just put it down. So you hold your level. Sink. Take away movement. The shot begins, you move. You did it again a little bit. Just, that's all it is. You're just trying to get the ball to the floor as much as possible. Ball's not allowed to go anywhere else. Flip the floor. Still did it. <laughs> there too? Yeah. Do you see it? You can shake the camera like this. Just, it, you're like this. It's like this. Watch, hold the ball right there and just do that. That's it. Okay. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> yes, that's what I mean. Oh, did it again. Better. You, you know what I mean? Yeah. That's what you're doing versus just going down. So if I was to dribble, I'm just going down, you know? <laughs> That's not the most important thing, but so if you drop that back full foot put all the weight down vertically, and then as that ball starts to go up here, then transition the weight to the toes. And then you come under, under the shot. You have to exaggerate that drop. You're still, you're, you're too high. I, I feel that I'm high. Yeah, you're, you're super high. You're like, you're like, it's like you're getting to here. Right, exaggerate. Can I start a little bit lower? Yeah, for sure. Okay. You start at where you wanna, start at where you wanna operate from. To get back to, you know? Yeah. One. Two. Game ball. Pretty. Foul line. Sit in that shot. Ready?
One. Two. Three more. Three. Rainbow. Good job, dude.